convert some of the existing lessons in SLS, for example, they are in the community gallery as an example. You can obviously do it for lessons that are in your drive as well. So let's say this is a, a blended learning guide that has five lessons here that are perhaps useful to be combined into a course because you probably know that gamification is coming out and there are some benefits to having a course like you can also just assign one course and then you can edit it on the fly as an assignment to your students and then you just have to assign it once and then the students can can always keep doing the same course over the course of perhaps a few weeks or maybe a term so quickly the the trick is you need to use a technique called star resources i have many other videos on star resources you can look at them so one way is to look at the lesson details when you click on the lesson detail then in this lesson detail there will be this star thing which you must star so you can start it the moment you start it it, it becomes like it, it is added to your catalog uh, like your whatsapp it become a, a a lesson that you can later draw on uh, okay so you star all this The other way to start is, of course, you can open up the lesson and you can also start it here. So the important thing here is we are starting the entire lesson uh, course. So you have to go to my drive uh, owned by me. So you have to create. So the, the trick is new course in this way. So you need to do, you need to select the course. Then just fill in some uh, simpler words first. So I, which I will not go ahead and do because I think these are quite simple. The trick is you need to then uh, uh, do this thing called the, uh, let me see, add. Okay, so after that, you need to add this. This is like the, the cover page, like the home page for the course. So this one, I will not edit it too much. But I think the, the biggest uh, benefit of having the star resource is you have, to, you have to click this thing called the section. And then typically, I will just choose the custom. And after this, do not copy and paste uh, singular items uh, over here is to add by activity because in the lessons that you start they are all stuck here under start under activity start resources so the moment you invoke this this thing here uh, under add activity then add from existing then you can see that all the wonderful things that you have been starring uh, from chapter uh, one and then chapter 2, chapter 3, chapter 4, chapter 5, all it can be added. So I'm just going to demo one very quickly, just demo one, add. And then you select all, because this has been stuck, so you select all. And all the uh, thumbnail, chapter title, everything will be copied over to the new course that I'm creating. So you can see very quickly everything has been copied here. So the trick again is then to, uh, let's say, progress normally i click on this big button here the section so i'll add another section again custom uh, again i will uh, this is the obviously the chapter two i will later on i will clean it up uh, but for demonstration i will not do it immediately because to save time then you can go to star resources and then you can continue to add chapter two so again i will select everything because this is a simple case of a uh, combining different lessons that are coherent i'm going to show you how the end product looks like so the end product is something like this i've already done uh, something here so in the course detail it will be very nicely shown obviously you have to copy all this uh, out and then the various chapters are over here then uh, i then i can see that the when you open it up then it will have all the benefits of the previous editors the previous contributor so i have taken the time to add back all the or uh, meta tags are uh, like a uh, course notes uh, keywords which was previously in the lesson now they become keywords in the course course tag previously was lesson tag now is course tag uh, there are certain tricks to to add this particular topic it could be difficult to to add the topics if you're not familiar with the with the subject and the level so after i sub selected the the subject and the level and the content map then i do a control f in the keyboard to find the word maybe say schedule and then uh, you can actually scroll through the topics there to then select it now so i again i add back all the previous authors that have contributed to the previous five lessons okay 
and this is how you do it so then i submit this course to community gallery to reshare back with the with the co with the community